Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Taurus. Okay, this is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and we are just going to see what comes up. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. This could happen at any time in the near future. So what do we have for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Let's do an update for Taurus. Happy birthday, Taurus. Mm -hmm. mm, came out reversed. You are not being practical. But it came out reversed. So when a card comes out reversed, it typically means that you are being practical. But I'm going to put it back in and we're going to try this again. You may or may not be being practical, so you may have to rethink something. So what do we have for Taurus? What do we have for Taurus? Unexpected help is arriving. This is like the star. Okay, so you got some unexpected help arriving. This is a wish being granted of some sort. Let's get another one. The outside looks grand, but the inside is a mess. Hmm. Eight, eight, eight. Eight is a number of change. It is a number of abundance. The time is now. The time is now. So this is great. Even though something isn't that good on the inside. Unexpected help is arriving. Maybe this help is going to help you deal with the inside mess. This is a change that is coming. It is very positive. This is movement. It is positive movement. It's an increase of abundance. The time is now. Something is going to be happening for you. Let's get one of these. Oh, community. Community. That's what fell out. Now, you may be meeting some new people within your community. You may be attending a get-together. This kind of reminds me of the Three of Cups. Uh, this could be a new tribe, new friends, um, hanging out with your friends, getting together with friends, um, engaging in the community more. There could be somebody that from your community that is, is coming to help you in some way. get one of these this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot just so you know life purpose and the star card even though this isn't the typical star card is a card of purpose okay this has to do with your life purpose. The purpose of your life is to serve in a way that brings great joy to yourself and others. Don't worry about finding your purpose. Instead, focus upon serving a purpose. And then your purpose will serve you. So this has to do with purpose. It has to do with serving others. And your service to others, it feels like your service to others is going to serve you. I almost feel like you're receiving. Well, obviously, there's some sort of unexpected help. And this is like a reward, the 888. It really is. That's like extreme abundance. What goes around comes around because it's like the infinity sign. It is It is the infinity sign. So you're, something is, is coming around for you, okay? And it has to do, and it's interesting because this is mirroring this one, and this is about service. So I feel like there's some sort of, your service maybe to your community is paying off. You're going to be receiving something for your service. 
Oh, these two fell out. Seven of Wands, Reverse, and the Ace of Swords. Now the Ace of Swords is clarity. It's a new idea. It's a, it's a, new, it's a new beginning. It's taking a new approach. It's some sort of truth, some sort of, it's the raw truth. This is a lightning bolt. So this there could be something that comes out of nowhere. It could be some sort of an epiphany, a wake-up call, a truth. You could be given some sort of power. Seven of Wands in reversed is stepping down from a position. This is the end of a battle. It's admitting defeat. It is um, giving up. It's giving up a fight but gaining some sort of power because that is the sword of power you're going to be it's, and this is well, that lightning bolt this is like a shock it feels like there's go, you're going to be shocked by something It's very, very sudden. Lightning comes out of nowhere. This is um, the seven of the seven of wands reversed is uh, a fall from power of some sort. Somebody, you may be there's some, some truth could be coming out. Somebody could be losing their power. They could be losing their position. This is giving up a position. It really is. This is somebody has been in a tough position. Now they're losing the position or they're walking away from the position. It could be either way. Admitting defeat. Giving up the battle. Stepping down. Somebody is stepping down. There's some there could be some new information that is coming out or some sort of truth that is coming out. This truth uh, removes somebody from a position of power. The truth is, so I feel like you're dealing with somebody who is a mess. This person has been competing. They are very highly competitive. This person is giving up their stance. This... Hmm. The sun... The sun is happiness, it is bliss, it is a breakthrough, it is a new beginning. We have a breakthrough here. This is light being shed on a situation. This is clarity. The Ace of Swords is clarity as well. Happy news is coming. You're going to be receiving something, some happy news. This could be a rebirth. It could be the news of a child. This could be the news of a birth of a child. This, it, Whatever it is, it's extremely happy news. This is bliss. Unexpected help is arriving that is going to make you extremely happy. The battle is over because the Seven of Wands is reversed. Somebody may have been fighting, I don't know, fighting what they wanted because they had to prove something. Maybe they're giving up the fight and they're doing something from the heart because the sun is all about heart. There is some, you're going to be receiving some communication from somebody. That makes you very, 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 very happy. This is what you wished for because the star card and is wish being granted. And the sun card is a yes answer. The answer is yes. You may be attending a get together, you know, where uh, somebody could make you feel weak because, it's, or I don't know. You do have a new beginning here, and there's no doubt about it. There is there is some sort of happy news or happy information or uh, something. It's going to shock you, okay? This is shocking news that is going to make you extremely happy. Um, the time is now. This is abundance. This is shining. You're probably in the with the star and the sun. Sun, you're going to be. You're shining. This is your time, right? It is your time. It is. It is. Uh, you know, it's your time. My mind has gone blank. Seriously, seriously blank. This is a shock. <laughs> it is a shock. 
right there too, but it's gone. I don't know what it is. It's phew. Anyhow, the sun card is happiness, bliss, vibrating at a very high level. This is a new beginning. Very, very, very happy news. It's a very healing energy. Seven of Cups. King of Cups and the world reversed. The world reversed is unfinished business. It's it's a lack of closure. Um, I wonder if there is somebody coming back around that shocks you. This could be a shock. I do believe, or there could just be some information. You may receive some information. The world card reversed is um, a lack of success. Okay, it is lack of success. It's it's uh, stuck in the present. Uh, refusing to move on, a need to move on, um, a lesson that hasn't been learned. I feel like there's some sort of illusion here. I feel like we have somebody here that needs to master their emotions. They need to move on from something. They need to step into new territory, but they're flogging a dead horse because of fantasy. And, I, and that, could be, that could be happening in the future, okay? Because this is towards the future. There's some sort of illusion here. You're dealing with somebody that is probably going to be expressing their feelings to you. This may seem like it is too good to be true, okay? It may seem like it's, it's you know, I think that you're going to have multiple options this month as well. I do believe that there is somebody that is going to be expressing their feelings to you that is probably going to shock you. This, there's probably, um, oh, that world card reverse, that's like, oh, frustrated. It's like stuck in the present. There's uh, not learning from mistakes. There's some sort of unfinished business. You, I don't know if, if you are dealing with somebody from your past. You may be dealing for, with somebody from your past that is um, made some sort of poor choice and now they're communicating with you. I don't know. I don't know. Um, the sun card is a breakthrough. It is a new beginning. It is very, very happy news. But this world card reversed is like a dead end. It really is a dead end. I mean, the world card reversed is... It's unfinished business, lack of closure, lack of success. I think you you have somebody that, I don't know, there's some sort of confusion here. I feel as though you're, you're going to need to really master your emotions and be real with yourself make sure that you are being real make sure that you are beware of your choices okay because what you own owns you something is coming around because of that 888 like i said what goes around comes around something is coming and it could be coming back around the infinity sign is endless love it it is it is it's an endless energy it's it's eternity right it's infinity so, you know, I don't know what is going on, but I feel like you have a new beginning here that is probably going to make you really, really, really happy. Um, I feel like you may be in a state of confusion, though, because I feel like what's going to happen is you're going to receive an offer. You may have unfinished business with your past that you have to give up. Maybe you have to give up because that, that Seven of Wands is giving up a battle, admitting defeat. Now, that could be somebody that you're dealing with or it could be you. You may need to give up your stance. You may need to stop fighting for something, okay? There is something unexpected arriving that is going to make you extremely happy. Um, you're going to be receiving... Uh, something that probably seems too good to be true. I feel like whatever this is, is going to um, test you. It is going to test you. It's going to test your uh, your growth. It's going to test your healing. I think that you've done a lot of healing. I think you've been through a period of healing with that sun card. Um, somebody's going to be expressing their feelings towards you and you may 
you may that world what is that world card that world card reversed seven of pentacles dead end i knew that it was i hate to say that dead end relocation somebody may want to this person may be at a distance you may be dealing with somebody that is at a distance and they may want to relocate to you They may want, or they may want you to relocate. Seven of Pentacles reverse is unrealistic, dissatisfied, a lack of investment. Somebody did not nurture something. They did not take care of something. And they had unfulfilled success in their previous situation. They may have jumped into it because they were trying to prove something. Seven is a prominent number here. Seven, seven, seven. <laughs> Unfaithful. I wonder because seven is a number of faith. Two of them, two of them are reversed. Lack of investment. This is somebody is really unhappy with a situation that has ended. There is some sort of choice here, and there is confusion. I feel like we have somebody here that has made a poor choice. <clears throat> I can't even talk. <coughs> Sorry, I had to take a drink. <clears throat> Put it this way. You are going to be receiving an offer or somebody's going to be expressing their heartfelt feelings for you. You may not want to invest in it because you may be unclear if this is a wise choice. There is an opportunity for a new beginning. It may require relocation, travel, for you or the other person. I feel like this person is at a distance. Or not. This person could be part of your community. Or, you know, it's interesting because community is over in the past. They may have been part of you. Maybe you lived by them in the past. <clears throat> could be dealing with a Leo. You could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Some sort of information or truth is going to come out about a person that you are dealing with. This person has been has made a poor choice. And there is some sort of unfinished business. And I feel like they may have invested in something that was short-lived. There was their short-lived success. It may have ended, okay? It may have ended and, you know, now they're expressing their feelings towards you. Everything happens for a reason. Everything happens for a purpose. We're talking about purpose now. Maybe, maybe, you know, everything does happen for a reason. <coughs> the sun is a card of growth. And I don't know why I can't speak. <clears throat> Anyhow, we have a new beginning here. An unexpected new beginning. It's something that you asked for. You asked for this. Whew. 
devil reversed and the devil reversed is breaking free from a toxic situation it is taking control okay this is somebody taking control it is um, yeah it's somebody taking back their power it is taking back their power breaking free from a toxic situation that was based on ego that was based on lust no longer investing in a toxic situation. I feel like somebody has broken free. They have broken free from something that wasn't healthy. Maybe it was an addiction, a bad behavior. No longer putting in any effort. No longer going down that path. You have an arrival as well. Somebody is coming in very, very, very fast. They are coming in out of nowhere. This person may not have invested in you because they were confused or they had other options or the, and they had unfinished business with somebody from their past, but now they've broken free and here they come, okay? Here they come. If you are in a relationship right now, you could have some, there's good news here. Whatever this is, this is really, 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 really good news. You have a new beginning. Maybe it's news of a child or... If you've been fighting, things are going to get better. I do see a sense of togetherness here. I do see celebrating, having fun, being very playful. Um, this is a time of abundance. You are going to be receiving some sort of very, very, very good news. And I feel like maybe you were, you know, one of this person's options and they needed to break free before they could come in your direction. That's for the singles or whatever. If you, like I said, if you are coupled, you're going to be receiving some good news as well, whatever it is. If there's been some sort of competition with your partner, if there's been a third party, I feel like the third party situation is over, okay? Very, very, very passionate. Somebody has their, they are coming in like wildfire. Could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, could be a Capricorn as well. Somebody has gotten a handle. They have gotten a handle on their illusions. They have gotten a handle on their addictions. They have broken free from some sort of bond or situation that they were tied to. They have broken free and they are coming towards you. This is the beginning of something new. It really is. And it is exciting. This is what you asked for. Open your heart. Good luck.